くじの縁というのがありますこれは「連票当社海順立財前」9つですねこの9つの円蔵これは円蔵伝来のものであってムドラーと言いますねサインです「連」これね、一つ一つまた信号が入ってます。恩バイスラマンタヤソワカ、恩イシャナヤインタラヤソワカというように全部ダラーヌ信号が入ってます。呪文ですね。連票。Each position of the hands is another prayer, and all nine together make the spell. 海、順、列、在、全。これが九つ。これがクズの円ですね。そしてこれが桃園、つけんの円、桃園。There are two ways of making the spell: either by making the hand prayer shapes or by drawing lines, each line representing one of the hand positions. It is then necessary to focus the spell, and that is why the tenth character is used. いつ上入れてやるのは、ひいほう、じゅうずのほう。じゅうずのほうね。じゅうずのほう。ひいほう、じゅうずのほう。例えば。船に乗るとき、船がひっくり返っても自分は助かるというの。それは、So for protection against drowning in a shipwreck, the warrior drew the spell on his hand and then wrote a tenth water character. 龍、龍というか、初代龍の龍。In battle, the warrior did the same to protect himself. Master Ataki thinks that the idea people have of fighting warriors as Zen Buddhists is quite wrong. To follow Zen. Is to spend many hours in contemplation, which he feels is quite unsuitable for fighting men. They needed a practical religion that could put them quickly into the right frame of mind to fight. To complete the cure, the magical spell is stroked over the patient. She must then take it away, place it on a river bank, and walk away without looking back. The training session for advanced students covers all types of weapons. For each weapon, there are special exercises. After the sword sessions, they move on to single sword against short and long swords. These were the weapons carried by the samurai until just over a century ago. They could, of course, choose to draw only one of their swords, but once both were unsheathed, special coordination had to be learned to use them effectively. Crossing the two blades is a way of blocking an attack without damaging the blades, and from there either sword can be brought in to cut the opponent down. Many fighting arts use a staff, called a bow by the Japanese. It is a brilliant weapon when handled by a master. The problem for a swordsman fighting against a longer weapon is how to get past it and reach his opponent. A well placed blow from an oak staff can shatter a sword blade or a helmet, but the sword can make a lethal wound by the lightest of touches. Encircling the sword blade with the tip of the staff can flick the sword out of its owner's hands. The fighter with the staff must, however, always stay out of reach of the swordsman, since he has no close quarters defense. Father and son practicing sword against halberd. These are the most spectacular and elaborate carters of all. The halberd is a deadly weapon, heavy. As sharp as a sword and able to reach the weak places in armor from a distance. No good swordsman would permit this, and yet he must move in to attacking range. Because of the length and weight of this weapon, it is held in the middle for balance. To counter these powerful strokes demands great skill from a swordsman. He only has a slight speed advantage, and the halberd has the butt end of its shaft available to parry blows.
The warrior's problem when fighting the long spear is different. The man holding a spear will always try to use it at a distance, and the problem for the swordsman is to prevent its powerful momentum striking him. The warrior must attack past the spear point, but his opponent can draw it back quickly. Master Otaki uses his full willpower and energy to fight his way through, but even then it is difficult to close with the spearman, who retreats. There are certainly many other techniques that the school thinks are too secret to be shown to outsiders. They would include unarmed combat using particularly dangerous techniques, since they were designed for the battlefield. Yet, at the heart of the teaching, in spite of the concentration on the art of killing, the founder's message is one of peace. He taught that fighting is the last resort, and to kill is evil. それと有名な熊笹の教えという教えを残しています。熊笹の教えっていうのは、カトルの道場のチュンペンには今でもたくさん入っていますけれども、細い角ですね、あの笹ですね。そこへ文芸者が訪ねてきたときには、人て教えを願いたいって来たときには、じゃあ門前な立ちぬ。その熊笹の上に小座を教えてそしてその上に長久先生を持ってこうシャッと潰れないですねさっと乗ってさあどうぞっていうことそうするとそれを見た文芸者はもう見ただけでもう毛穴が争奪になってね自分が乗ったらぐちゃぐちゃっとこう倒れますからそれ長久先生は小座の上に自然としてもう座ってられる。その真似はできないんです。マスターアタキ、despises the samurai who went around searching for fights and triumphantly killing. He thinks that they led distorted lives and that it's wrong for them to be admired. They left nothing, but the founder of the Katori Shinto Ryu left a family that continues after twenty generations and a school that has made no compromises in its teachings. Since the 15th century, and yet retains relevance for its 20th century pupils. The balance between the art of killing and following a moral way of life is one that many masters of fighting arts maintain. For them, and for Master Ataki, the arts of war are also the way of peace. <laughs> 